Mark Vaughn, Georgia Torwood, August 1st, 2011. This is the as received material from Lee Thompson. And this is to uh, document the uh, treatability study. Uh, the material was run through our uh, hammer mill to quarter inch minus. As you can see, this is the material. As it was received, it was received at about 47% moisture by weight, by weight. Uh, the material was dried back uh, using just basically the uh, outdoor uh, Indian air method for four to five days. It ranged about 97 to 100 degrees. Uh, the material is going into the unit at approximately 17% moisture. We're running our feed right here at 300 RPMs. Yes, 300 and yeah, 307 RPMs. We're feeding six seconds on, 12 seconds off. 30 minutes uh, on the hour. Let me see here. Our retort is our flare is at uh, 1464. The retort unit is just over a thousand degrees. The outlet temperature is 610. The front is almost 800 degrees. I've got it uh, loaded hot in the front to take out the excess moisture. The middle is at 580 degrees and then cooling off in the rear about 466. As you can see, we're producing no emissions at this time. And we've been running a steady, consistent stream of uh, condensation that is being removed from our sand gas unit here. Uh, going around to the back. Going around back here to the back. Uh, now to view the material as it's produced. Okay, Otis, go ahead and turn it on. Whew. You can see this material's pretty well torrified, extremely hot, it looks very good. The uh, larger particles here are from the, uh, this is probably 90 to 95, probably 95% bark material, and that's the uh, round uh, semi-elongated uh, particles that you see here. Uh, they're just like tiny little balls, a lot of them. Uh, maybe I can spread it out just a touch more so that you can see, there we go. You can see that's about 95% bark, and this is uh, Lee, Lee Thompson from uh, British Columbia, his uh, treatability study. And there you have it. The material's going to be uh, sent to the laboratory for percent moisture, BTU, uh, and maybe ash concentration. Being it, it, This is bark, and it's pretty hot normally, or pretty high rather, in uh, and ash content, we're going to probably get an ash percentage on this on the uh, on the control sample, which will be the dried back virgin feedstock, hammered quarter inch minus, and then the uh, the finished product as well. Look at this test, but again, it's no emissions, and uh, everything's functioning as it should. Mark Vaughn, Georgia Torwood, August 1st, 2011. Thank you.